All right, let's move on now to the third email today. And the third email today comes to us from Michelle O'Brien, who writes, Hey, John, you turned me on to Runaways. Oh, I love that show. And I just fell in love with it. Just saw a trailer for the new second season, and it looks amazing. Have you had a chance to see it yet, and what did you think? All right, thanks a lot for the question, Michelle, and I'm so glad you got turned on to Runaways. One of my favorite things about this show is when I get to introduce you guys to something maybe you haven't checked out before, and when you guys introduce me to some things I haven't checked out before, it's one of the best things about being film fans and in a community together. Anyway, I'm so glad you had a chance to check out Runaways. Of course, a property a Marvel property that was originally planned to be a movie in the MCU. They scrapped those plans and then went to Hulu and have the Runaways series on Hulu. And while I love the Runaways comics, and I, they're Anne's favorite comics, they, by, by far, the Runaways is Anne's favorite comic series. Uh, that includes Saga, that includes all that kind of stuff. Runaways is her favorite. And she's the one who turned me on to Runaways. While the comics are great, the TV series has taken a lot of liberties. That Runaways Season 1 has taken a lot of liberties. It's clearly Runaways. All the building blocks and all the bones of the Runaways comic book series is there. But then they go in a lot of different directions as well. And I'll tell you what, forget the expectations from the comics. Runaways is a great show. So much better than Cloak and Dagger. Anyway, Runaways is a great show. They just have done a marvelous job with it. And we know it's coming December 21st, same day that Aquaman opens. Hmm, Hulu is dropping Marvel's The Runaways Season 2 on December 21st. And I've been really excited about it. And you're right, the first trailer, the first real trailer for Season 2 has now dropped. And I loved it. I loved it. It looks like the kids are now changing gears from just being these confused kids about what are our parents doing to now? We need to start acting as a team, blah, blah, blah. I love the fact that they do a little bit of mix between a practical rubber dinosaur and then CGI when they need to do it. I like the dynamics of the kids. I like the interactions between all of them. I like the relationships between all of them. I think each member of the Runaways are, have very unique personalities, yet they all blend in perfectly well together. And each episode just draws you into the next. And I thought this trailer for season two builds on that. I'm looking forward to seeing a little bit more of their abilities. That's one of the things they really did show off in this trailer, is that while season one was more about the story and setting everything up, it looks like, if we take the trailer seriously, that season two is going to show off more about what they can do. Built on the foundation of what they did in season one, to me, that is freaking exciting. I love this show. I cannot wait for it to come back. That's going to be a busy weekend, because, guys, we've got... We got to watch Mary Poppins. We got to see Spider-Man in the Spider-Verse. We got to watch Mortal Engines. We got to watch Bumblebee. We got to watch Aquaman. We got to watch Welcome to Marwin. And, by the way, season two of, you know, uh, of uh, Runaways is dropping on December 21st as well. It's going to be a busy couple of weeks, but I cannot wait. I'm just giddy. I am just giddy. And we're only like two and a half weeks away from being right in the meat of it. I'm so excited. 